I want you to look your opponent dead in the eye and then tell him the first thing you should know about me is that I am not you. And once we get through with this situation right here, it will all make sense. See, I'm wired different. I'm built different. I'm built to last. I love what Will Smith said. He said, if me and you get on a treadmill and we turn it into a contest of who can stay on the treadmill the longest, either you lose or I'm dead. See, I'm just built different. I'm cut from a different cloth. I came here to give every ounce of my soul, to give every ounce of my heart, to give every ounce of my being. So what I'm seeing is me conquering any situation. It's me conquering any endeavor. It's me conquering any goal. It's me arriving at my destination of next level greatness. What do you see? Do you feel in your heart of hearts? Do you feel in your mind that you are built different? That you are an unbreakable force? That you are unstoppable? That you put in all the work? You put in all the sweat. You put in all the blood, the tears. Overcame all the fears. And now you refuse to lose. You refuse to quit. You refuse to give up. Because in your mind, quitting, throwing in the towel, losing, leaving, vacating, evacuating, abandoning ship, is never ever an option. You, my friend, are built different. You think different. You react different. Everything about you is different. If they can't understand that, if they can't embrace the real you, if they can't embrace the true you, then you keep being okay with being who you are and make them feel it. Take that respect, because the day will come when the things that you are doing that are so different become the new norm. And they start following your lead, and they start following your trend. Embrace your different, because it's what makes you great. Your time is now. They may have laughed at you in the past, but now, you laugh at them when you milk that cash cow because you put in all the hard work. You did things that people thought were crazy. You did things that people thought were stupid. You did things that people thought were asinine. But they couldn't walk a mile in your moccasins. These are your dreams. These are your aspirations. And you have to use your God-given gifts, your God-given talents, your God-given abilities to go get them. So when they say you're a little bit different, you stand up and shout at the top of your lungs, yes, I am. I'm wired different. I'm built different. And I am God's body because God gave me a gift. And before I leave this earth, I plan to use it. Embrace your different, because that's what gives you an advantage. This is a great day.